her only opportunity to slip him the poison was in the cocktail party when she gave him a drink. That was much earlier in the evening, and he would have been dead a long time ago if that were the case. Are you saying I could have killed Jim without kissing him? Well, I said just that water. Nine, but the real killer was Barney Cullen. He shot him during the disco dance with the darts from his, the poison darts from his watch. I had to do it. I was tired of his incompetence. I didn't know Jim wore diapers. <laughs> now, this will surely make you not uh, eligible for being the team leader. However, it could be an opportunity. I could use a man like you in my network of evil. What do you say? Oh, uh, all right. Uh, can I interest you in some sticky gloves? <laughs> wow. Mm -hmm. They do make a lovely couple, don't they? Yeah, I guess they do. Who are they? <laughs> Shall we dance this one out? Yeah, sure, might as well. Yes, Ooh. this ain't half my left certificate, could be yours. It's suitable for framing 
working in your home or office. Did you imagine the excitement that you would have if you take this home and post it on your refrigerator just to embarrass your children? <laughs> it says that the above named person is a private eye, a shame is a flat foot, a real honest to goodness private dick, and it's signed by your lot of homes, so you know it's all many. All right, thank you, Dueling Vanis. Now, <laughs> we had a number of people who, who guessed Barney Hollander, and we had one who got exactly right, but we will get there when we get there. Our first uh, runner-up winner is Peggy Lore. Peggy Lore. Peggy. Also the brother of Data. Brother of Data. Is this a real Star Trek? Star Star Trek. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> uh, all right, uh, our next one is Cora. 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 All right. The same table must have caught you. Okay. The smart Our team. Our next winner is Leslie All, all uh, Leslie All something. Yes. Leslie All something. Al Thomas. Al Thomas. Yeah. Sorry, I'm very poor at reading. Or writing or arithmetic. Okay. Our next uh, prize winner is George Nemeth, brother of Joe. George. Our last year's champ, right? right? <laughs> Our next one is uh, John Whitehead. Ah, right here. All right. Okay. Our next one uh, is a very famous. Only goes by one name, Sean. 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 All right. There we go. Oh, our next person is also famous for he only goes by one name, Ken. 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 Oh, there he is. Oh. <laughs> our next person is also famous. They go by one name, Donna. Does your last name happen to be Summers? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The dead, the dead one. <laughs> Our next person is Vito. Vito. I'm guessing Corleone. <laughs> <laughs> and our grand prize winner not only gets this super stitch, which we know is more than your wildest dreams possibly conjure up, but they also get something else. And what is that? Um, if I can. There you go. Dueling Vanna White. Oh. <laughs> All right. This this envelope. There's more because inside is a certificate for Grey Lakes Classic Corner. And it's a, it's a, it's a nice certificate. I don't know what the hell it is. It's <laughs> two complimentary dinner theater. So, just like another couple here, uh, you are going to be forced to come back next year to see yet another mystery dinner theater. Damn, oh, next year's right. ruined already. Oh, and all we ask is you bring a table with eight, we're going to pay. Yeah. Or ten. So we'll take ten. Okay. Now our uh, lucky winner is Scott Garrison. Garrison? Garrison. Uh, All right. Uh, it's it's uh, curly. It's curly, yes. <laughs> now while we're, all the attention is at this back table, we have a special anniversary, a couple of spending their third and wedding anniversary here with us this evening. So I'm a big round of applause for our lovely couple. Yeah. And after they saw the show, it's their last anniversary. <laughs> no, but I also give out the awards to people who didn't quite get it right. And you get one you really deserve, and that is a clue. Yes, the clueless detective award, also signed by Sherlock Holmes. This person, yeah, because it says, because he or she obviously does not have one. This one said, it was Colin Carr. How do I know the gloves fit? <laughs> well, you know, the gloves fit and it fit. <laughs> Melissa Sigioli? How you pronounce that, Melissa? Where are you, Melissa? Where's Melissa? Back there. She remembers OJ. Yeah. This person said it was Mary Conn Halen. How do I know? Well, the poison was on the disco ball. It was poison to the touch. I kind of like that. It could be a murder mystery writer. Yeah. Davis Hoffman. Oh, yeah. Davis Hoffman. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Oh. Little did you know we ran out of these and she had to run upstairs to get one. Janet Sharp! Where's Janet? Nice. Look at this class her. Who did it? Jim Yelps. He committed suicide when he pushed the button and he danced himself to death. <laughs> Teresa Clayton. It was such fine dancing. Wasn't it? Who did it? Mary Claude Halen. How do I know? He has killer looks. What a ladies' man. And, and it goes on the back. What would you change about the show? Well, the broken arm. And, and the favorite part of the show, the panty line. Yeah. Well, for my line show, Mindy. Very nice. I'm sorry, I didn't realize I was showing. This person said, who did it? I have no idea, but I love whatever's in that syringe. <laughs> Yeah. And our last clueless detective said it was Colin Carr. How do I know? He resents Yelps, the team leader, for always making him cross-dress, especially when Peach is not his color. <laughs> Vera! <laughs> Thank you guys so much. This we are Mystery Theater Unlimited, our best form of advertisement, often our only one, is by word of mouth. So if you like what you saw, please tell all your friends. But if you didn't like it, keep your mouth shut! Happy New Year! Happy New Year!